Hi, in this video we're going to discuss a few universal techniques that are going to speed up your work across the entire computer. Most of these techniques are going to work in some way in virtually any program anywhere across your whole computer, hence the term universal. Because each of these is going to work in more than one program, I'm going to demonstrate each of these techniques in at least two programs to show you kind of a variety of how they can work, but then I'm going to leave the exploration up to you. For example, we're going to talk about how to copy and paste. That can work in lots of different programs. Let's get started with copy-paste. I have a friend of mine uh, named John that emailed me uh, wanting uh, uh, some contact information for, from a friend of ours named Joe uh, who can help him with his computer. So I'm going to start a new message here and send it to John. Here. I'm going to type that in. Now I'm going to open my address book and I have Joe's information here. Now I could click in my email over here on the left and type in all this information, but I've already typed it in once here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move my mouse over the text that I want. I'm going to click and hold on my mouse and I'm going to drag it down to the opposite corner of the text that I want. And you'll notice that as I move my mouse it highlights some of this text in blue. Okay, So I'm going to highlight everything that I want in blue and then I'm going to go up to edit and here's my copy command. Almost every program on your whole computer will have copy right here under edit. Uh, so click on copy then you have to go back to the place where you want to put this information. So I'm going to click one time on my email here, make sure that my cursor is blinking here, ready for me to type there. And I'm going to go back up to edit in mail, and now paste is an option. So I'm going to paste uh, Joe's contact information there. Uh, to demonstrate how this could work in another program, I'm going to close address book, and I'm going to get the contact information of a company that can help uh, John with his computer. I want to give him his their physical mailing address. So I'm just going to click and drag across here to get their uh, mailing address and go back up to edit. This time I'm going to use my keyboard shortcut. Notice on the left side, right side here, it says Command C for copy. So on my keyboard, I'm going to hold down the Command key and press C. And now that's copied it into the computer's short term memory. So now I can close this window, go back to my email address, move down a little bit. And my command for paste is right here, command V. So on my keyboard, I'm going to hit command and V. And it's going to paste the information there. And I'm just going to title that interlaced, a good company to help them out with that. So that's just one example, uh, or I guess two examples, of how you can copy and paste between different programs. Again, it's always going to be under edit, copy, or cut. will work similarly, but we'll remove information. Either one of these is going to uh, put information in your computer's short-term memory, and then you can paste it anywhere that you want. Uh, go ahead and open up TextEdit or Pages or Microsoft Word and uh, practice, or you could practice it in a mail message. Just um, get some information, select it. This time I'm going to do cut because I want to remove it. So I'm going to cut it, and it takes out Joe's information, and then I want to put it down at the bottom instead. So now I can go down here and say paste. So go ahead and uh, explore around with your copy and paste commands. Um, it's a great way to save you time retyping stuff.